The entertainment series of Irving kicks off their season with sounds from Havana and sights from a lot of different places, and we'll find about that now with Jorge Fernandez. Thank you so much for being here today, Jorge. Thank you, Kathy. I am tickled to, to find out that the entertainment series of Irving sort of found you on the doorstep of the Mustang Museum. You'll have to tell me how that all came about. Yes, no, it's a, it's, a, it's a great opportunity for me. Um, uh, about two years ago, I, I moved to, um, to Dallas and uh, Irving specifically to, to work here in Irving. And uh, when I was doing my research about um, uh, Irving, Texas, I had never been here before, by the way. Uh, probably one of the first things that come up when you Google Irving is the, uh, the Mustangs, right? Where he, and, I'm uh, sure, loves that. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, yes. yes. It's, it's, it's an iconic, uh, um, it's a landmark, if you will, of, mm -hmm. of Irving. And um, so for about two or three months, I was wondering, so where are these Mustangs? Where, where are the, the famous horses, right? So a friend of mine told me, there ain't no corner by the, uh, by the big building. And I drove by and I saw this beautiful statue of, of the horses and I thought it was uh, very impressive, very beautiful. So then I learned that there is a museum which uh, celebrates the, uh, the life and work of, of the artists who created the, uh, the statues. And uh, so I went to the museum one day, that's where I met uh, Mary, and I was talking to her. I told her that I was uh, uh, born in Cuba, that I lived in Venezuela, in Puerto Rico. I told her about my life and my, my interest and very especially with, uh, with my art. And she said, you know, we're going to have a group of Cuban musicians in October. It will be a great opportunity for you to show your, 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 uh, your art, your work there at the, uh, at the show. Would you like to, uh, to have a, a small exhibit? And I said, of course, it's, it's a, the perfect excuse since I'm looking for a place to, to show my work. And yeah. here I am. I think that it's absolutely wonderful. Um, I don't know that, that we can really do any justice to your work showing on a note card, but it's really gorgeous uh, landscapes Thank I'm you. looking at and beautiful colors. And although those places that you're showing are not Havana, which is where the group Habaneros is from, uh, you sort of got a little evocative because of all of the color and the richness and such. And so that's kind of nice. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, a lot of my work um, represents my uh, my interest, right? I've, I've been lucky enough to travel a lot uh, um, in, I've lived in different countries, in Cuba, of course, in Venezuela, in Puerto Rico, I've traveled all over uh, Europe. And that's what my, my work represents, uh, uh, the different places that I've been to. Um, there will be a, a raffle for one of my pieces Great. of, uh, of a landscape in Cuba. I decided to donate that to the uh, Irving Entertainment uh, Series so they can uh, raffle that and get some, um, uh, some money for, for their for their for their cause yeah, and uh, they'll be donating that and that, that is a landscape from from Cuba. That's wonderful and very exciting. So the evening will be your beautiful artwork and the beautiful music of the Habaneros. That will be Monday, October 6th. The concert starts at 630, but around six o'clock, if you come, you might even get a chance to meet the artist. So Absolutely. <laughs> Jorge, thank you so much for being here. I'm very excited about about the this sort of dual opportunity to see and hear Havana right here in Irving, Texas. Yes, me too. <laughs> To. It's my first show in, in Texas, and I'm very, very happy for this great opportunity. Well, great. Thank you so much. Thank you.